Hello guys, welcome back to Vichar Tips. In this video, I am going to talk about how to fix Windows 10 camera error code 0XA00F4292 and how to fix this up. So let's get started. So first thing what you have to do is you just have to search here for Windows Defender Firewall. As you can see that you have to search for this and you have to open this and you have to click on Hello and F4 feature through Windows Defender Firewall. You have to navigate this and you have to select this. Now from here you have to navigate to change settings and you have to select this and from here you have to go for hello another app and from here you have to browse the respective app. For the time being I'll be going to you have to go to local disk C and you have to select windows and system32 and from here you have to go for app locker and most probably you will be having a file here which you have to select this and go for open. Right? Once after it is being done it will be available over here and make sure it is there and just go for ok. And after closing this, what you have to do is you just have to check whether the issue is solved or not. If it's not solved, then we have another solution. So next one is all about you just have to search for here. You just have to search for uh, registry editor. You just have to search for this and you just have to run as administrator and you have to go for yes. And from here, you just have to follow my next instruction. So as you can see that uh, I made a few changes over here for my last video. So I just uh, let me make this like an undo. So uh, I'll be doing the respective one. So you just have to uh, make sure all these things just clear these things and this is how it looks like basically. Now from here you have to first thing what you have to do is you just have to select. Uh, you just have to uh, select the H key local machine you have to select the H key local machine and from here you have to select software and from here you have to navigate slowly to Microsoft you have to navigate slowly to Microsoft and from here from the Microsoft you just have to go for Windows Media Foundation you just have to go for Windows Media Foundation you just have to scroll down a little bit and uh, you just have to go for Windows Media Foundation Windows Media Foundation as you can see that Windows Media Foundation you just have to click on this and from here this is how it looks by default this is how it it's been and now you have to right click and go for new and you have to go for D word 32 bit value you just have to create a new one so what you have to create is you just have to type enable uh, you just have to make first letter of all three words like we have a word just enable frame frame server mode Okay, you just have to make this and you just have to open this and make sure the value is zero and once you have to go for ok and try to restart if it's not working then you just have to click on once again and make it one and go for ok and try to restart this is the second step and moving on to the last step is all about what you have to do is you just have to go to windows powershell you just have to search for windows powershell you just have to search for uh, windows powershell and you have to click on run as administrator and go for yes and once after selecting this i'll be giving two uh, things you just have to copy paste here just copy copy this one and paste over here and press enter and wait for the operation to get completed and once after that you just have to copy the respective one you'll be having both the things in the description so you don't have to worry just copy paste this and press enter and most probably this will be able to do this and once after that just restart your pc and most probably see if the issue will be fixed by doing these all things the most probably the issue will be fixed and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video any doubts to ask in the comment section peace out